Hi everyone. Drinking water, is water that safe to drink? In this video, we are going to learn about dehydration and overhydration. Dehydration is excessive loss of body water. There are three types of dehydration. Hypotonic, loss of electrolytes. Hypertonic, loss of water. And isotonic, equal loss of water and electrolytes. Electrolytes are essential minerals like sodium, calcium, and potassium that carries an electric charge. Exposure to hot weather can cause dehydration. When body temperature rises with little to no sweat, may cause overheating. There are three stages of overheating, which are Heat stress, heat exhaustion and heat stroke. Next, let's see the symptoms of dehydration. The symptoms of dehydration can divide it into two. Moderate and severe symptoms. Examples of moderate symptoms are Urinating and sweating less than usual, dark colored urine, dry mouth and tongue, sleepiness, physical fatigue, feeling thirsty, headache, and dizziness. Examples of severe symptoms are Constipation, rapid heartbeat and breathing, sunken eyes, easily annoyed and provoked to anger. Does sugar dehydrate you? The answer is yes. Sugar can dehydrate you. Do you know how? The excess sugar enters the stomach and bloodstream absorbs that sugar. Next, to balance the high sugar concentration in the bloodstream, water from the cells moves or flow into the blood. This leads to decreases in the water volume in the cells. Finally, leads to dehydration. Have you ever wonder, is coffee dehydrating or hydrating? The answer is dehydration. Caffeine in coffee may have a small short-term diuretic effect which can lead to a minor dehydration effect. Do you know why drinking alcohol causes dehydration? Like coffee, alcohol also has a diuretic effect on the body. If you don't drink enough water with alcohol, you can become dehydrated quickly. But remember, that alcohol can interfere with the brain and kidney communication which can lead to dehydration. There are a lot of drinks, do you know what is best or worst drinks for your body? Examples of best drinks are Plain water, milk, fruit infused water, no sugar, fruit juice, watermelon, sports drinks, tea, caffeine free, coconut water, and milk alternatives. And examples of worst drinks are Soda, beer, wine and hard liquor, hot cocoa, coffee, lemonade or sweetened iced tea, energy drinks, flavored milk, and smoothies. Let's move on to overhydration. Overhydration is also known as water intoxication or hyperhydration. It happens when a person drinks more water than their kidneys can get rid of via urine, and leads to low sodium levels in the bloodstream. Point to note, that every hour, a healthy kidney at rest can excrete 800 milliliters to 1000 milliliters of water only. Signs of overhydration Normal urine should be in shades of yellow. If your urine color is crystal clear every time, it means you are drinking too much of water than your body required. The second sign is passing urine frequently especially at night. Please remember if the first and second sign happens frequently at night. It is a warning that you should decrease the water intake immediately. Third sign. Experiencing nausea, vomiting. When you drink a lot of water, your kidneys cannot hold it in and the water starts to collect around the body. This can further result in abdominal infections, including uneasiness of the stomach as well as vomiting. Fourth sign swollen feet, hands, or lips. Bloating and swelling may also make you gain weight. Fifth sign, headache, fatigued and tired due to sodium levels in your blood to drop and hydrogen level has been increased. Lastly, 
too much of electrolytes in your body can cause diarrhea too. These are the signs that show that you are drinking more water. Effects of Overhydration Overhydration may affect brain functions. Excess water leads to swelling of the brain cells. Overhydration may also cause mild to severe headaches, and build up of fluid in the lungs. Next, overhydration also cause poor or delayed digestion. Lastly, overhydration can lead to mood or energy fluctuation due to low blood sodium. How to prevent overhydration? Thirst is the body's natural reaction to fight dehydration. So drink water when you are thirsty. Use your urine color as a guide. Healthy urine should be in shades of yellow. Always listen to your body. Stay hydrated. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video.